Hey beautiful and welcome to Cultivating Inner Beauty where we're all about loving our healthy selves from hair, skin, and nutrition and that my friend starts from within. So have you ever got on a weight loss journey and you've been eating right, you're doing all the workouts, but now you're noticing that you're not really losing as much weight as you did in the beginning? That my friend is your weight loss plateau. But in this video, I'm going to tell you how you could get past it and continue to lose your weight. So how does this happen? Okay, so in the beginning, you're probably losing a lot of weight in your weight loss journey. And what's really happening is that maybe you've uh, decided to do like a diet or something and you decided to cut your calories. And so now your body is in a shock because it's used to eating a more, way more calories throughout the day. And now you decided to restrain it by eating less calories. And so your body needs to have some kind of source to continue to get its energy. And so now it's going to glycogen, which is stored in our muscles and in our liver. And glycogen is partly made with water. And so as your body continues to get energy from glycogen, uh, because it's partly made with water, you're gonna notice weight loss happen extremely fast because that's where the body is getting its energy from. And when you lose weight, you're actually losing fat in your muscle. And your muscle is actually what keeps up the rate of how you burn your calories, AKA your metabolism. Even though there are factors that can affect the rate of our metabolism, like our body size and composition, our age, as well as our gender, there are some ways that we can still get past our plateau with these three tips that I'm about so to So the first way to get out of your plateau is to eat foods that will naturally boost your metabolism. I shared this in one of my previous videos, five types of foods that will boost your metabolism. And I talked about thermogenic foods, I talked about broccoli, um, I talked about ginger, cayenne pepper, but look at that into detail. That's gonna help you greatly in continuing to lose your weight. The second tip is to get more out of your workout. So don't just stay on the treadmill and the Stairmaster, but actually go to the dumbbells and do the free weights because this is what's gonna help you to burn more fat. Um, some people may think that lifting weights will make you look manly, but it's not true. Uh, lifting weights, it will help you to burn more fat by increasing your muscle. And that's what you want to look for when you're uh, trying to get past your plateau. So lift those weights and watch how you're going to burn that fat. Now, my third tip for you is to take a break from dieting. Now, there's nothing wrong with mindful eating, which is what I mostly focus on. And you want to continue to eat healthy in that perspective. But as it goes with dieting and um, just all these different types of diets, sometimes it's good to take a break from it and let your body adjust and then go back into it. And this will um, help your body to continue to get past that plateau. Okay guys, so that's my quick spill on plateauing. I hope this was helpful for you guys. Share in the comments, what are you doing to uh, continue to lose weight? And if you have some more advice for other people, then we wanna hear from you. So be sure to share and I will talk to you next time. Bye beautiful.